think that um, the perception of apprenticeships is changing and is going to change even more and I think the, the work that employers like us are doing um, and universities and training providers are doing has been really important in sort of we mentioned the stigma around apprenticeships and banishing that and, and presenting them as, as a really, really viable alternative to university or to going straight into the workplace. And I think when it comes to apprenticeships, you're getting the best of the best of those both those worlds. Um, and I think university perhaps doesn't hold the sway that it that it once did when it comes to uh, when it comes to employers in the future. And I think um, as, as Ryan and Dan both said, the advantage that they're getting is that they're, they're learning on the job um, and in, in many cases once you've been to university and you start a job you need to do professional qualifications anyway, um, whereas Ryan and Dan and, and their cohorts are doing those qualifications whilst they're learning. Um, and you know, as I mentioned earlier, that learning journey doesn't stop, so there's nothing to stop them in the future going on to do level five, level six qualifications, which, which takes them to that kind of that degree level.